Hey guys, I want to share with you this premium pet cart. This thing is super nice. Obviously, you would hope so for the price of $395. Um, but my miniature Dutch Hound seemed to really love it. She's elderly. She's 15 years old. She just can't get around like she would like and she still wants to be a part of activities. So this is actually really perfect for her. Um, and if she gets overstimulated, you can close, you know, the um, top part so that she still has ventilation, but that she also just has a little bit of space. And she honestly loved this thing. She just laid right down and was just so happy um, to be in here. There was no issues or anything like that. Um, and she fit perfectly and was super comfortable. So, um... The zipper works great on this. There's good material. It is a little difficult with one hand, and I did have, um, you know, to flip that zipper back over there, but it does zip up. It's just more user air with one hand than anything. So, but she loved it. It also moves really smoothly. Um, these wheels are great. Turning radius is great, easy to maneuver, and the handle was comfortable um, to hold it will go over different kinds of terrain works really well you also get some comforts here so you have a little um, purse area where you can put in this fit my 6.5 inch phone um, you can put your keys you can fit quite a bit in that little pouch there so that was perfect too um, the only thing is is that when you do have cups it might be difficult to kind of access your zippers you can fit water bottles um, your drinks they're not super large cup holders so it is um, smaller drinks but you know they stayed in while I was moving the cart around and doing different things and overall that's a really great feature you also can lock it in place so it doesn't roll and the locks work great and are super easy to utilize you just press the red um, pedal on the bottom and then it's locked and then you just pull it back up with your foot so I really liked um, that option as well so you can take this to the farmer's market, take it to the grocery store, take it wherever you're needing. You have a 70 pound, 75 pound capacity down there. I had um, five pounds of potatoes and some groceries and there was no problem. This also folds up super easy. Um, you simply just pull the levers on the front. They're big red buttons so you can't miss them. Um, Inside the bassinet is a removable pad that you can clean. It's also a really nice soft material that will be comfortable for your pet. Um, and all this folds up if you're just wanting to utilize, you know, the, the grocery basket. The grocery basket also folds up um, and I'm going to get you some measurements on all of this shortly. So it has a really nice um, kind of foamy um, handle here and you can adjust this handle. So there's two red buttons on each side. You have to depress them at the same time. And then you can adjust that to any height that you need um, in any way that you need that to be adjusted. So that's a super great feature and will work for different height levels of individuals and also is great for um, storing purposes. So there's lots of different adjustments with this um, and it's really easy to do and I'm even doing this while recording so you can see how easy it was. Um, but overall this is just excellent quality craftsmanship. Everything you know would be what you would expect at this price point and um, is nice. So I'm showing you here that that is how you adjust that fully down for folding and um, of course the more you remove the you know easier it is going to be for storage as far as how compact it's going to be the actual purse or cup holder thing that is attached to this is easily removed if you don't want to use that um, or if you're trying to you know store that it does just come off with a couple clips and the velcro um, wrapping there so if you're leaving this with the wheels on, it is a little bit thicker to store. So let me just kind of show you here the measurements. So you're at about 19 inches um, with the wheels on, and that's going to be the maximum width, width that you will need for this if you want to just leave the wheels on because you don't want to take them off or, or deal with that. Um, and you know, that's certainly an option, especially if you're using this quite frequently. 
So to remove the wheels, they have little buttons on there that you just um, pull or push and then you're able to pull the, the wheel out. And as I was showing you, that has a nice craftsmanship of um, support underneath there, but as you saw, it was just really super simple to remove. You just press that button and then pull. And kind of the same thing on the other side, there's a button there on the side and then you just um, pull that out and then super easy to remove. So overall, this really did become quite compact and I'll show you kind of how I stored this. So it also has a little strap, it's only on one side to kind of compress that or to keep it together. So once I removed this, you're looking at about 11 inches is kind of the smallest amount that you can, you can get this for storage purposes. And I have some suggestions for that too. So you see I have those wheels out. So this is also about 29 inches um, top to bottom for the height of it or width depending upon how you're storing it. And then approximately about 11 inches um, tall. So the basket for storage is approximately 16 and a half or 17 inches. And then by um, approximately 20 inches. So that's how much storage capacity you have for your farmer market stuff, your you know outings to the lake, the beach, wherever you may be using this. And then it's um, approximately 14 inches high. Inside you have approximately 18. So the top does kind of go out a little bit and the inside is just a little bit um, smaller. So the bassinet itself is approximately um, I would say 19 inches wide so you want to make sure that your you know your pet is going to be able to fit inside this and then it's about seven inches tall just inside the little basket and then as far as uh, across it is approximately 11 and a half inches so overall I for my puppy, she's 15 years old, she's um, a mini Dutch Hound and she fit just fine. So I was able to put the wheels inside for storage and then I just placed the cup holder or purse bag in there as well. Um, and they fit and I didn't think that it was going to cause any problems. I did end up flipping this around the other way because I felt like it fit better and was more protected um, the other way. But with the wheels, what I did was I got um, some straps that you use for electronics and I strapped them on there and that was a good way for me to um, manage and contain everything together but make it nice for storage. So, well I hope you found this helpful. I wish you well and happy shopping. Have a great day.